New accusations tonight are emerging against an instructor at Sunnyside High School convicted of sex crimes this summer. Action News anchor Corin Hoggard shows us why a lawsuit claims Fresno Unified is partly responsible. Two months ago, Tusai Vang left court in handcuffs after admitting to an illicit relationship with a high school student. He was five years older than his victim, but he told the judge he'd fallen for her. I really did love her. Um, I did have plans for her in the future. Um, it really did break my heart when she told me about the other guy. I'm sorry, Your Honor. Vang is already out of jail after serving a 120-day sentence, and the judge decided he won't have to register as a sex offender. But now he's facing a lawsuit from the girl's family, accusing him of grooming the 15-year-old almost as soon as he got the job teaching percussion. Legal analyst Tony Capozzi says the conviction means Vang is already at a disadvantage in the civil suit. Clearly he's liable. Uh, if this can be proven, but he's not the deep pocket. Uh, the plaintiffs are after the school district because they're the ones with the, the money and the insurance policy to cover any kind of damages here. Capozzi says it's tough for any employer to avoid hiring a future sex offender unless background checks reveal a checkered past, and this was Vang's first criminal conviction. But the lawsuit claims the high school's band director allowed Vang to give the victim rides to school while he was grooming her. And then some of the sexual activity happened at the school-sponsored Sunnyside Band Camp. Instructor having a relationship with a student, that's forbidden. Um, and the fact that it took place on school grounds or at a school activity, I think really ties it more so into the school. An attorney for the girl's family told me Vang may have a pattern of similar behavior. He says Vang tried to groom another Sunnyside student after the first victim broke up with him and before police arrested him. I tried to track him down to ask about it, but nobody answered the door at Vang's home. A Fresno Unified spokesperson told me the district can't comment on pending litigation. They're all due for a meeting in court early next year.